Hey, what's going on, guys? We're gonna come back with another campaign. We're gonna continue the story on Titanfall 2. Welcome to the team. Welcome to the stream. Oh, I'm sorry, not stream, but recording. This is recorded. I'm um, having some difficulties with my gaming card, so I'm just gonna record this one. Let me show you. So I'm gonna make this as like minimal commentary, just gameplay really. So maybe a mixture of highlights or uh, a little bit of both. Um, but yeah, we're gonna see how far we can get on the story. Um, I think we think we went through like four chapters already, I think already. So yeah. All right, here we go guys. Pilot, Major Anderson is here. Investigate this facility. I will meet you on the other side. Don't get captured again, BT. I will avoid all shortcuts. bad feeling about this. The time disturbances in the area are a plausible cause of your ailment. Medical routine J-12 suggests slow and deep breaths. Neutralizing the militia forces, we will in fact safeguard the existence of the human race, extending it.
Lest we lose sight of the bigger picture, remember those losses are ultimately replaceable by the inexorable march of human reproduction. By decisively neutralizing the militia forces, we will in fact safeguard the existence of the human race, extending its reach of power towards a prosperous and bright future. to everyone here. Their bodies have aged unusually. However, some show signs of weapon fire. Hopefully Anderson's alive. Anderson is a veteran SRS pilot. He has survived multiple covert missions within enemy territory. Strange. I'm picking up traces of my own data signature within this area. The distortions must be affecting my scans. Interesting. I'm detecting traces of a massive energy explosion throughout this facility. However, your helmet data does not detect the same in the other timeline.
Isn't it the wood then? Like turn them on your side? Wasn't there? I thought there was. This is Dr. Colby Marvin. I don't know how to explain it, but a Vanguard class Titan just appeared out of nowhere. The test is still underway. It will be completed. None of these remains match the genetic profile of Major Anderson. He may still be alive. I recommend you check the main lobby of reception. I would accompany you, but unfortunately my chassis will not fit through the door. Oh, lucky you. I detect sarcasm. <laughs> I'm detecting a faint biosignature on the upper level of the reception lobby. Recommend you investigate. I found Anderson. He's, uh, in the ceiling. Objective complete. We have rendezvoused with Major Anderson. Very funny. My intention was not humor. Congratulations on your field promotion, Pilot Cooper. The following is Anderson's mission briefing from Commander Sarah Briggs of the Militia SRS. Major Anderson, two weeks ago we intercepted IMC comms. They found something on Tyson. A massive blast of energy was discharged at this location, creating time distortions. I want SRS on the ground to infiltrate the facility. Roger that. I'll get some answers. This wrist-mounted device we recovered during Operation Grizzly should protect you. We know the IMC have contracted Kuban Blisk and his mercenaries to protect something critical there. So watch your back. And Anderson, you know how much I love writing death reports, so don't go it alone. The SRS is a team. Pilot, 
The data Major Anderson collected appears to be incomplete. We are duty bound to uphold and fulfill Special Operation 217. Recommend we locate Anderson's wrist mounted device before proceeding. I didn't see any device on Anderson. It must be on the other half of his corpse. I detect a breach in the security services building. I will provide access. I will remain here and scan the ring structure while you investigate the facility for intel and the missing device. Nice. Maybe next time you can throw me. Noted. Dr. Alexander Darren, log 14.6. The intruder has some kind of advanced tech and is slaughtering our response teams. Tyler and Wildlife Research said two teams were taken out of the elevator banks in a matter of seconds by one guy.
sorry, Henderson. Stay alert. Who 
is Dr. Colby Marvin. He's from...
going forward with this. The test must be completed. Pilot, a fragment of Anderson's damaged log may be relevant here. Activating log playback. Place of log 341. The IMC found something, all right. It can fold space and time. It sure as hell didn't build it, but they're restoring it. Whatever they're planning, it's potentially catastrophic. Anderson now. Log 342. The fold weapons power source is called the Ark. Doesn't look like they've perfected the casing. This one's empty. The Ark must be somewhere else. Anderson out. Ark prepped for delivery and en route to the test chamber.
Dr. Ehrenberg, log 11.4. Further research still leaves questions about the fold weapon and its intended purpose. I don't think we're using it right, and that may cause a problem. Marder thinks it's worth it. Well, I'm going on record. This is a bad idea. Log 21B, Human Specimen 3.4. The experiments on the IMS Odyssey's colonists are underway. Soon we will discover the long-lasting effects the Ark has on organic matter and brain function.
The rings at my location contained a large amount of residual energy. This was the Ark's final destination. Anderson's plan indicated a recon mission within close proximity to the center of the active rings. You want me to do what? If we can obtain the Ark's energy signature, the militia fleet will be able to track its current location in the present day.
They were targeting this planet's moon as a test. This damn thing was just a test. One of our own planets is next. They're going to hit Harmony. And they moved up the timeline. I have to get this intel to Sarah. Right there, pilot. I'm located. Okay. <laughs> Major Anderson's final recording. Cooper, based on your recon of this facility, I may have a plan. Meet me outside. I would like to spend some time today to talk about the value of human life. There is no value to human life. Now that I have your attention, to be more precise, human life to a certain limit is expendable. We are self-perpetuating yet self-destructive, adaptable yet flawed, and always, always resource intensive. have now been deployed in all non-combatant sectors. Please display security credentials clearly to avoid... Automated security personnel, please target all non-IMC military subjects. Pilot, I recommend you meet me at the rings in order to scan the Ark's energy signature.
some sonar pulse to assist you. you took in the past have caused the remaining automated security systems to be quite hostile towards us in the present. Sonar pulse activated.
down. Uphold the mission. I have marked the bridge controls on your HUD. You will need to extend the bridge before the full weapon test pad explodes. Dr. Altamirano, log 7.6. General Marder is gone. He's making our stay to complete the test. I don't trust this thing. The Ark is unstable. to reach the Ark under any circumstances.
थी discovered, the IMC intend to destroy the militia planet of Harmony using the full-scale version of this weapon. Pilot Cooper, our journey is far from over. We must get this data to the fleet. Well, that was pretty cool. I have to admit, that was, uh, that was pretty neat. I like that. I like that was good. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and keep going. We're gonna do one more chapter. And then, uh, then we'll go ahead and pause it for, for this session of Titanfall 2. Let's go. Pilot Cooper, Anderson is dead, but we can complete his mission if we can re-establish contact with the fleet. The interstellar beacon ahead will serve our needs. And if we don't get over there in time? Forty million souls on the planet Harmony will be lost. We must get this information to SRS Commander Sarah Briggs. Pilot, I see the beacon up ahead. Scans detect minimal power functionality. It may need repairs. I'm picking up multiple contacts. Hostiles confirmed. The stalkers appear to be programmed to attack the control room. Caution. I detect traces of poisonous chemicals within the fog. I can handle it. Unlikely, pilot. The fog is deadly to organic life. We cannot uphold the mission if you are dead. You will be safe in the cockpit. Controls transferred to pilot. Pilot, I'm detecting militia forces inside that region control room. They are signaling distress. Patching in. stalkers and then make direct contact with the militia riflemen.
chassis can eliminate smaller enemies. Victory has raised our combat efficiency rating. BT-7274 to militia forces. All threats have been eliminated. You saved our asses. Those stalkers just kept on coming. We may not have lasted much longer. We're opening the blast doors. Come on in. Island and Tiger on the lift. McCord, bring them up. Let's go. Right away, sir. Pilot, recommend you disembark. Captain, what is the status of the beacon? The power is shut down. We've lost all control of the beacon. We need something like this to jumpstart the system, but this one's destroyed. Designation, arc tool. Function, generates power up to five megajoules. Yeah, yeah, we know what it is. Can you repair it? Nah, we already tried. Sensors indicate another one in the substation, but it's nearly impossible to get down there. This place just ain't built for humans. Understood. Pilot Cooper, I advise caution while navigating this facility substation. You must recover the arc tool. Good luck, sir. Hope you make it back. We've lost too many down there. Taking out Demeter was a huge victory for us. Why doesn't it feel that way? Well, Good luck, Pilot. Marvin Delta 73 Zulu, please report to Sector Bravo 7. Careful, people. These stalkers can come out of the walls. Stay alert. Who is this loudspeaker talking to? It's not like these tin cans speak English. Maybe they can. We're doing our best down here. Pilot, more stalkers are expected. We'll hold them off, but don't be gone too long. This place is run by machines. There's an elevator around here. I wonder how deep this facility goes. It looks like they can turn a up to protect their heads. That's why they're so hard to kill. The last pilot in our unit went that way a few hours ago, but he never came back. Be careful. Pilot, I have patched into your helmet display to monitor your progress. The channel is open if you need assistance. BT, remind me what I'm doing here. Your mission is to obtain an arc tool. Using it, we can jumpstart the power systems and get the beacon back online. Scans detected signature further within this facility substation. Got it. BT, what's up with these walls? Scanning. Exposed power circuits. You should avoid physical contact. Proceed forward with caution.
place. The station's computer details this location as the power grid for an IMC interstellar beacon. The maze down here. How deep does this thing go? Scans reveal a maximum depth of 300 meters.
That was impressive, pilot. They're waiting for you back in the control room. They must be stepping up their pilot training. Work out more about your brother. Welcome back, sir. Let's move to something else. That's not in the pilot handbook. Pilot's back, and that looks like an arc tool to me. I think we just gotta pick it off this dirt ball. Good work, Pilot Cooper. Now we can jumpstart the power to get the beacon functional. Cable is secure, Captain. Glad you made it back, Cooper. Just in time, too. This is wired. Now all we need is some power. Pilot, the power chamber relays are offline. The arc tool should be able to jumpstart them manually. Cooper, let's hope that arc tool was worth all the trouble. High radiation levels detected ahead. Your suit will only protect you for a limited time inside the chamber. I suggest you move quickly. I wouldn't stay in there too long unless you want to be burnt to a crisp. Get that arc tool ready. When I open the hatch, every second will count. Okay, opening the hatch in three, two, one, go! are on their way. That is a reasonable assumption. McCord, can we bypass the module? No, sir. Not unless we want to send a message to the entire IMC fleet. Then the module is going to have to be repaired manually. Pilot, this situation could use your skills. I hope you're up for another trip to hell, Cooper. You'll need to repair the beacon on site and get back here as fast as possible. Pilot mode engaged. this pilot as an exceptional fighter, proven well during the fracture operation. What's fracture? Fracture was the code name of a major combat refueling operation conducted by the militia on the planet Victor. We sustained many casualties, but the fleet survived. Damn.
My scans detect a functioning uplink targeting module, 428 meters northeast. My analysis indicates a throw is our only option here. I can throw you across the gap. That's insane. I am incapable of insanity, pilot. That's exactly what someone insane would say. Wind, three knots, heading 274. Range, 95 meters. Projectile mass, 89 kilograms. Trust me. Good throw. You're welcome, pilot. Good luck over there. Richter, this is Blisk. Yeah, yes, yeah, Richter. That damn pilot is trying to use the beacon. End this. I'm counting on you. Blisk out. All security units, this is Richter. Get to the beacon now. Find the kleine Mann and lass mich nicht hängen. Copy that. Zulu 1, Kilo 1, move in. Alpha 2, get soldiers on ground. Move in! IMC dropships headed to your location.
on the suspect. Sighted, headed your way. Acknowledge. Kilo 14, do you copy? Come in, Kilo 14. All units, Kilo 14 is not responding. Prepare to engage the target in Beacon 4. Copy that. In position in Beacon 4 gantry. Standing by the intercept.
Module detected. Check your HUD. Zulu 1 6, Beacon 4 Gantry Team is KIA. Pilot may be attempting to transmit from there. Zulu 1 6 Director, the pilot's intentions are unknown. He may be attempting to draw us away from the Titan. 9, focus on the pilot. I have other plans for the Titan.
Pilot, the module is in the projector of that dish. Titan squads have arrived, requesting assistance. Engaging hostile infantry. Target needs to put him down! Old front! Target spike down there! Recommend we secure this area before proceeding with the repairs.
threats eliminated. Area secure. Are you okay, pilot? Hell yeah. I'm on a hot streak. Your vitals do not indicate a temperature problem. Do you wish for me to investigate this hot streak sensation further? It's just an expression, BT. It means I've been killing a lot of enemies quickly. Understood. I have added hot streak to my vocabulary. I have had numerous hot streaks within the past 38 standard hours. Protocol 2, mission update. Replace the uplink module. The socket for the module is at the top of this dish. A throw combined with additional climbing is required. This is Sloan. Go ahead. Kane and Ash are dead. Someone's been killing your mercs, and it looks like one of our radios has been nicked. I knew you shouldn't have hired those tossers. Hi, <laughs> right, pilot. This is Cuban Blisk. You've been listening to us, eh? You want to be a hero, yeah? Okay. Keep coming at me. Keep coming. But if I were you, I'd stop trying so hard to be a hero. You'll live longer. will automatically reorient itself once the new module is installed.
back here and we'll send this message to the fleet. Outstanding work. Richter, this is Blist. Yeah, yeah, I'm already on my way. Richter out. Intercept and destroy their pilot, then execute the remaining militia troops. Reapers inbound. Militia forces, lock down the control room. Threats detected. Copy that. Locking down. We will assist from here. See what you got up close and personal. Would have been better had it been a kleiner Junge. Let's begin to eat the yolk. Excessive damage. Warning. Warning. Precise. Don't get shot. Time to die, Kleinerman.
battery required. Lass uns das schnell zu Ende bringen. Disembark. Protocol 2. Uphold the mission. Report intel to the fleet attached to the SRS unit. Solid copy. Good to hear you guys are still down there. We're receiving your data now. BT-7274. Your data recorder says your original pilot was KIA. Correct. Captain Ty Lastimosa was killed in action. I am now linked to an acting pilot, Rifleman Jack Cooper. Wait a minute. Lastimosa linked you to a rifleman? Yes. He had no other options. Understood. We'll get you transferred to a fully qualified pilot. Objection. Cooper is my pilot. Our combat effectiveness rating now exceeds 90%. Request permission to retain this link. You're lucky our backs are up against the wall, BT. Permission granted. That's high praise coming from a machine, Cooper. Thanks to your scan data of the Ark, we've tracked its energy signature to an IMC base right here on Typhon. We don't have much time. Let's go.
looks like we linked up with everybody and we got reinforcements. I get to stay a pilot. But I'm going to go ahead and call it for this video. Stay tuned for the last part. We're going to finish this off. It's been a great campaign. I like it. It's challenging. Um, but it's just fun. Overall fun. I mean, you just can never. I mean, I don't know. For me, just can never get. It can't get old. Playing, uh, you know, like your soldier and then mechs together. Um, so, yeah. Thanks for joining in. Until next time, guys. I'll see you around.